Now running around the bottom of this part, we've got this pin, and this pin is supposed to be populated into all of these additional holes. We could do that by adding additional instances of the pin, but we could also do it by using this command up top here, replicate. And what replicate does is it lets us pick this pin and then it examines the mate that's related to that pin. We've got this fastened mate that's related to this pin. Then I can choose a face from the model and any identical edges will automatically get a copy of that component in the correct location. So in a scenario like this, where we created a circular pattern of that original hole, this really works well. It gives me exactly the right number of instances. And if I was to go back and change that circular pattern, we would see the number of pins update automatically. So Replicate is a great tool to learn about. It really helps you keep your assemblies efficient and it really helps you quickly populate those assemblies with the correct number of components.